So, what's up, SV Squad? Um, today, like, where's your lips, sis? Where's your lips? Aloha Samoa and happy Samoan language week. Olo Uingo, O Victoria King, Olo O Maui Nei, Canberra, O Sitalia. Guys, we're finally home now. I'm just setting up my things because I really want to do a mukbang ASMR today. I'm not sure which one it's going to be. I don't look my best today, but I just want to come up here. I am wearing something, guys. I'm wearing a t-shirt, okay? So don't even get me. Anyways, so I lost my wallet three weeks ago, and I only just realized about a week and a half ago because I don't ever... I cannot be the only one that does this. I know I'm not the only one that does this. I don't take my wallet... I don't take my wallet anywhere. I just rely on Aussie's wallet because we have like joint cards and stuff. So I'm like, oh yeah, if, he, if I'm ever with him, I no need to take my wallet. He's driving, just use his wallet. And so um, I, for the life of me, could not remember. I have been bending over and looking under chairs and tables and beds for like the past two weeks trying to look for my wallet. And then I thought, actually, let me call around. So I called like several police stations where I've been around my area. I called some shopping centers that I've been to like Aldi, Woolies. Like I just really had to sit here and really like access my memory box. And I vaguely remembered me putting it somewhere. I remember being in a shop and I didn't know which shop it was, but I remember putting it somewhere and saying, okay, I better not forget that. And then I turned to like something in a bag or put something in the trolley. I thought I have been growing a green thumb lately. So let me call Bunnings. And that's where it was. It was at Bunnings guys. My hair is just something else. So it's a Friday. And I have to work tomorrow. I'm waiting for Aussie to come home so I can go and get my wallet and then go and get my dad's blower so we can rake up all the leaves. Like this time last year, mum and Mia were here. Aussie's mum and his sister. And they used to like rake up all the leaves because it's actually winter. The leaves have been falling down and I don't know why, but our tree out of like all, the, all of our area, our trees just seems to be the worst. Our tree at the front of our house is just blowing it everywhere and I know that the neighbors are getting a little bit cranky so I'm gonna go get my dad's blower and see if I can suck up all those leaves but that's after work stuff so yeah I just want to come up here and uh, talk to you and, uh, it has taken me like an hour maybe two hours to try and drink this I mean I usually can drink it but I just don't feel like it today it's an apple cider and water doesn't smell very pleasant, but I'm so used to it. I don't want to finish it. I don't want to drink it. I'm just not feeling it right now. I'm just really not feeling it. Look at that pimple. Guys, I'm going to go on my break now. Um, also, just got home. I can hear his car playing music outside. And I'm going to go pick up my wallet. And you guys are going to come with me. Here's a little hack for you. You get the Windows key and L and it'll lock your screen for you. Okay guys, these are the leaves. After we pick up the, um, after we pick up my wallet, I just wanna go and, and pick up my dad's blower. Cause you see all these leaves? Yeah. All us, over there. Guys, see this is why I hate when Aussie parks so close to this corner. You see this? Our butts are not built the same. Oh, let's go, baby. What's up, people? What's up, party people? Why you turn off my music for? Because we don't need it. What is up, guys? Welcome back. Welcome back. So today we've got a auntie and nephew and uncle day. We got Evan Hazer. We're gonna go pick up Eddie. Say something, don't be rude. Say hi to the viewers. Hi. Eddie, say hi. We got the second rascal. Hi, Eddie, say something. Hi. No, you say hi. hi. Where are we going, Eddie? I know. I know. Where? It's me. It's okay, me. well, you don't need to be angry about it. What, Evan? 
It's me! No way! Okay, so what? What? Say what you're going to say. Daddy, it's me! Okay, Evan, where are we going? To the shop. Eddie, is that right? Yeah. We've not picked up the camera all day and yesterday since the last clip. But we woke up early this morning, we walked to my parents, this is the second time now I've walked to my parents. It's 4Ks away, but we take a shortcut which makes it 1K per way, so 2Ks all up. And we're just about to go and pick up some, um, oh we didn't get any bags babe. Is that big fucker? Well no, but I don't want to buy a bag. So we're going to Aldi's to get um, just a couple things, and then to Coles. Mm -hmm. And um, I just did like a really, you know those games that you play on Instagram? It's so hilarious. I just did one of those games and I thought a word was something else of a male genital. And it was actually spine. And oh my gosh, I was in hysterics for a while. But anyways, Aussie's also got a TikTok now. TikTok boy. Yep. Drop, your at, drop your app. At Siosi Key, so yeah. No, real dot Siosi Key. Ah, oh, real dot Siosi Key. Yeah. Follow me on TikTok so you can see my entertainment for you guys. Yeah. I don't really have a TikTok. I mean, I had one and then I deleted it because I just. It's not about that TikTok life, but Aussie's just created one, so make sure you go ahead and follow him, guys. Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. It's probably the same vlog, but because. We just don't be vlogging. Today is my Friday, it's actually Thursday, but I've got tomorrow off. And I thought, this is a vlog day. We're gonna get two vlogs up this weekend. It is the long weekend. But I also volunteered to work as well on the Monday. So two Mondays in a row we have as a public holiday. And I'm working both Mondays, guys. I'm working both Mondays. Even though Aussie didn't want me to, but if you guys aren't following me on Instagram, go ahead and click the link in the description box below and my details are there but i showed a couple of weeks ago this thing was like so so tiny it was still in the stem of the mother one now look at it it's fully grown fully bloomed and then this one over here was the same i just feel like a proud mother <laughs> But I'm still in my jammy jams. I am so excited because today is parcel day. Parcel, parcel, parcel. <sighs> but I just wanted to pick up the camera because I'm on my tea break and usually I do a workout and I just really don't want to do it today, but I'm going to force myself to do it. I'm going to do it. This isolation really, really, really went so bad for me. I was just like eating whatever. And then this month, I decided that I wasn't going to um, eat whatever and I was going to try and be better, do workouts. I've been walking three to four Ks a day. I mean, that's a lot for me. I'm just doing home exercises and I think it's paying off, guys. Let me know if you think it's paying off too. I'm going to be posting a video on my personal channel of what I've actually been doing. So if you're not subscribed, go ahead. The link to my second channel is popping up somewhere. Okay, sorry for these morning looks. I'm just like waiting for my parcel. Can they hurry up? I got my dad some shoes. Actually, I'm not going to tell you. I'm going to unbox it with you guys. It's going to be like a, you know, informal unboxing. Guys, I finished my workout um, about 20 minutes ago. I forgot to come back on here and let you guys know that I did do it. Because I was feeling really unmotivated and I just didn't want to do it. But I did it. So, I'm just on my break right now and I'm here to do a highly requested video from no one ever. Unboxing my purchases. Ooh! So I ordered Aussie some shoes because those red ones, we've had them for about three years now and they're just overworn. I'm sick of seeing them. They've been everywhere. This is a size 14, the other ones are a 15, but I mean, these were the only ones in stock, so this will have to do, Aussie, I'm sorry. I ordered my dad some shoes because I order him a pair every year. I think he's due for another pair, so got him some New Balance. Ooh, I like these and he will love these. Daddy, your new shoes. Look at this, it's got like a ridge. And then last but not least, actually I've got another parcel there, but I mean, I could have got my mum some, but 
my mum pampers herself every now and then. Like she buys herself shoes and stuff. My dad, unless someone else buys it for him, he will not. So I got myself some white. Ooh, some white. This, wow, these are nice. And then lastly, guys, I got this. And this is my mic stand. I will show you guys later. I gotta get back to work, guys, but I'll see you guys after work when Aussie gets home. I just finished work, guys. It's my Friday today because I'm not working tomorrow, which is actually Friday. I'm so excited. It's my weekend. So Aussie's come. I was meant to walk to my parents, but then I thought I'm not gonna carry my dad's shoes there. And it's also my excuse. But I told Aussie to come and pick me up. He's picking Darnell up from school because he works right next to Darnell's school. And then he's going to come pick me up. And then I'm going to go my dad's shoes to him. Yeah, I forgot to show you. This is my mic stand. Um, that I got here. My pop filter. And my microphone down there. So uh, I'm just waiting for Aussie to hurry up. Just want to get out of here. I just want to get out of here. <laughs> I'm so excited for the weekend. It's my nephew's birthday, sorry. You know. <laughs> what if I had lips like this? I mean, I don't mean anything by anyone who ever has lips like that. I'm just saying for my facial structure, what if I had lips like that? What if I had thin lips like this? This is so freaking ugly. <laughs> so what's up SV squad? Um, today, like, where's your lip, sis? Where's your lip? So today, we're just going to go shopping today because um, what we're looking for is a little lip because um, I've lost mine and the lip is not present. And, um, oh, there's my teeth. Hello. Okay, seriously, I gotta turn this camera on because Bye guys! I can't see you! Hey, 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 what up G? Hi. Just finished school? Yeah. Did you do it tight today? No. Daniel, that is too tight. No, it's not. You're gonna make marks in your neck again. Mm -hmm. Hey boo! Fantastic. Dad likes his shoes. Wonderful. Oh my Canberra, <clears throat> Prepare a gift for your travels or for your journey. You know, growing up, my father always used to say to my siblings and I, anytime we would go anywhere, the pastor's house, a cousin's house, a friend's house, a birthday, a wedding, he would always say, You cannot go empty handed. And in the same way, this year's theme rings true within me because it's instilled within me and I believe it's instilled within our culture. The same way when we travel back home, we go and visit our family and friends back in Samoa, we always prepare gifts for them from here, <clears throat> from wherever we are, we always take gifts back for our loved ones. So guys, that is my small encouragement for you guys today. Hope everyone's enjoying their Samoan language week. And that's it from me. Bye. Good morning guys and welcome to another vlog. It is Friday, it's my day off and and I just felt like doing comment of the day before we go any further because I haven't done comment of the day for a while. I really got to get going because I got to drop my car off at 8. It's 7.30, the place is pretty far. But quickly comment of the day on my last vlog that I posted which is my mom's prank. The prank that I did on my mom. One I'll just do randomly. Kalaliwa. Kala. Kalilawa. Kalilawa. This is the best you've done so far. Waiyawi. Isa. 
So thanks, Josh. And the next one, I'm going to give it to Denise Selman Duffer. Your parents are hilarious. Love them. Crack up. And Molly and your dad saying to take your plants back. Good one. Um, so thank you, Denise Selman Duffer. Thank you guys so much for commenting on our vlogs and for always staying tuned with us. Um, we know you love those pranks, so I am planning another one. But I got to get going. It's really, really cold. It's probably like seven degrees outside. It's really dull. As you can see, quite dull. All right, guys, I'm about to jet off now. I have not driven in such a long time. I'll be surprised if I even remember how to drive or which side of the road to stay on. But it feels weird to be behind a driver's seat. Usually Aussie's always driving or... I mean, I drive to my parents in Aussie's car, but that's just like five minute drive. I love this song. When I am weak, you are the treasure that I seek. Hey, Mama Boo Boo. Let's go for a car. Let's say yeah, old boy. I just got here. They're already here. <laughs> All right, guys. It's time for the baby to go in. It says open over there. Oh, yeah, I don't know. Oh, actually. Yeah, that's his car, mom. Yeah. Like, oh, you're late. Oh, no, i Let's go to SV Squad. It's fine, man. It's okay. Oh, boy, you're younger. Now. Go. Oh, you're younger. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you're all over So, so, yeah, cool one. It's good guys. Um we're here at car window tilting to fix baby Victoria baby's Victoria's car. And yeah. And yeah. Let's go inside guys, let's go. Samoa week, everyone. God bless you all, all you Samoans. Hope you guys had a good week this week. God bless you all, and see you in the next video. Peace. So I've been home for about an hour and a half, and I just came to wash my dishes, vacuum my house, run some washing, and I had some tea. So now I'm heading back to my parents. I'm in the little minivan. And I just want to say, like, are you even Samoan or an islander if you did not own a little van growing up sometime in your lifetime? I almost forgot how to drive this thing because the brake's on the ground. It's a Tarago. My dad brought this cash outright back in 1999 or 2000. I was around six to seven years old, and I can't believe I'm still driving it now at 27 years old i'm still driving this thing my dad just will not let it go he just can't let it go and so here we are with this baby it's almost 30 years old can you believe that oh wait it's only 20 years old never mind yeah so i'm about to head back to mom and dad's and spend the day there i'm gonna try and edit some vlogs and plan a mukbang for you guys this week was samoan language week and i had so much in plan but it just did not go to plan so mm, so off we go off we go the guys the aspect of anger is that it helps us to recognize something is wrong somewhere I think, is Molly going through anger management? Upset. Realizing that you are caught with anger is the right way to begin to deal with it. All I don't know how to turn this down. Something. We're about so, to go get my car now. In the present moment, uh, Molly's going to take me. Hold on. Oh, there we go. I muted it. Yeah, we're going to go and pick up my car now. My tinted car. But we got to get a Philip first to get this piece that I want for my microphone. Guys, we're finally home now. I'm just setting up my things because I really want to do a mukbang ASMR today. I'm not sure which one it's going to be. But... 
I just need like a riser. I've got like a desk riser, but like, uh, I don't know.